Welcome to March 2021, our housing report at the first quarter mark of this fun year. So I'm starting here. I'm starting with average sales price to show you the difference between 2010 to 2021. So a little over a decade here. We all remember the news and how bad things were in 2012. And here's 2012, a few ups, few downs, a little bit of a sag. Here we are today, we're way out here. 578 is our average sales price right now for single family homes. 362 average sales price for attached homes here in Fort Collins. So I think I'm, I wanna show this to you because I know there's a bunch of us who are saying, when are things gonna get back to normal? When is the market gonna uh, regulate again? When are we gonna find some relief? And I feel like if, if I'm advising you as a buyer and I say, oh, just wait a little bit longer, things might come back into um, what we used to consider as normal. I don't know if I'm doing any favors because this is one year, this is two years, this is three years. That appreciation is massive. And so I want to help us all to recognize this is probably our new normal, right? This is the new market in Fort Collins. This is our new prices. If they come down, Hooray, we'll have a, a market where there's more buyers that are uh, able to purchase and sellers will still get a, a great return for their properties. But I don't want you to hold on and hold on and hold on and think somehow we're gonna get relief. Um, relief on how many houses are available, maybe. Let's take a look here. This is some good news. We can see here just these last one, two, three months. It's an upward trend. You can kind of see that same upward trend each year. This is on listing volume. How many listings hit our market? We're still down 24% from March last year. That's a, a re very restricted market, right? From here, way down to here, but we're on the right trend. See that trend every year, we've had this trend at the beginning of the year where listings show up again, and we're seeing listings show up again. So we're hopeful, right? Everyone's hopeful that we'll have more listings show up in our market so that buyers have something to purchase out there. Uh, if you're looking to buy, we've been in and out of multiple contracts. Happy to help you get into one. Um, it's, uh, it takes a little bit different skill set right now than it ever has in the past. So uh, if you need help as a buyer, reach out to us. We'll help you figure out how to navigate this market. As a seller, um, different skill set again, right? How do we hold off accepting a great offer, hoping to get a perfect offer? It's something we're working through on all of our listings right now. So if you want help with a listing, uh, making sure that you're taking advantage of this market as much as you can, reach out. We'll, we'll take care of you on the listing side as well. Let's look at the high and low, see where we're at. Here's our low, least expensive home in the market is three bed, two bath, 2,200 square feet at $375,000. Very cute little home, I love that right here in March. So that's good to see. And then this one in March, um, top of our market, 1.75 million. What does that get you? 5,300 square feet, right? With some nice outbuildings. And in this setting, it's just south and just east of Horsetooth Reservoir. So you've got a beautiful setting, super close to town, easy to get in and out, um, and a beautiful home, absolutely gorgeous up there. So if you wanna see a house at the top, you wanna see a house at the bottom, you wanna see a house at the average, let us know, we'll get you in and out of them. Thanks.